what is going on you guys so I did it I did what I said I'd do and it took many many hours but I did it I did do it in creative mode and this should be pretty obvious to you once you see this because this is absolutely bonkers all right here it is look at that guys isn't that just nuts this arch is insane. Alright, let's quit playing games. Let's switch over into creative mode so we can take a real look at this thing. Look at that, guys. Isn't that just insane? So that's what I meant by it's not going to be a traditional structure. Look at that. Alright, so cut the Xbox footage out. Let me tell you guys how I made this. So let me shrink myself down here. Um, I have no idea if that's going to look cool, but what I did was I went in Excel and I made an arch and what I had did was um, I just took a shape of a circle and I blew it up really big, big in Excel and then I made sure to make the cells of equal like height and width and then I like colored in all of the cells with this gray um, color and put like a, the number one in all of them. And then as I progressed along the arch, I would mark them yellow to note my, to myself that I was done. And um, I would try to remember uh, like where I was at and stuff. So it may look a little rough at some parts because, um, you know, it's made out of squares. It's a circular shape made out of squares. But it's really going to be rounded out by what, I, by what I plan to do with it. So as you see here, I kind of already got it going on. I'm trying not to compromise the shape of it in this direction very much, but I have some balconies with trees on there. This is going to be living space. I don't know if you guys have seen this angle yet. No, you haven't, but this is hollowed out. This is... Let's just punch right in there and fly inside. Let me show you guys. This is, oh! Oh, this is a little too early of a sneak peek for you. Let's just get in there. Actually, firstly and foremostly, we've got ourselves a, um, a zombie villager here. So, let's go ahead and cure this guy. There he is. Alright, first let's hit him with that splash potion of weakness. Oh, that's not how you do it. I got him, okay. And then I feed him the apple. Okay, there it goes. Is it working? It looks like it's working. The sword always changed color. Alright, while he's healing, let me show you guys what else I did. This is something I got going on below this arch. So, you probably recognize this from the other part. This is like a New York City, you know, underground subway looking type deal. Am I... Am I affected by this potion of weakness here? Oh my goodness. How embarrassing. Um, how do you cure that again? With milk? Alright, guys. I know I'm in creative mode, but let's drink this milk. Alright. I look all better now, except for this stance. Alright, there we go. Alright, let's go head down here. Since this is kind of like a building episode, I'm staying in creative. So this actually connects with the other hallway I've made. I haven't hollowed out this area entirely yet. But I just filled this place up with some beds. I wanted to get some serious villager, um... Wow, what are these guys all doing over here? These guys are honestly probably just like restless. They don't have any like workspaces in here. Um, so they're probably just hanging out. Let's see if these guys are just hanging out in here as well. Oops. I do not want to trade, sir. Alright, they, they look like they're heading out. Or they're actually just kind of like commingling. How weird. I bet if I put some sort of a workstation at the top of these stairs, they would all go bananas. So let's check this guy out. This guy's still healing. So anyway, let's go ahead and go into our tower that I've been working on. Or actually the arch. It's above the clouds, guys. Okay, so this first little room, you know what, it's just like a workspace area. Oh, looks like I have a little dark workspace in here. Can I like make this light? What is that? It's like a weird shape. Is that like a cauldron or something? I'm trying to get some light in here. Oh, it's a bed. He's like, what are you doing? 
So is he. Where can I put some light at? Oh, that's a good spot. Beautiful. Alright, let's keep heading out. And so, man, it's dark in here, too. What am I doing with this lighting situation? Alright, so, we have our first uh, patio here, so... I'm trying to make this, like, eventually, hopefully, like, a mountainscape. An arch mountain. Um, with these balconies coming all off of the, the rooms. And then, um, I got some other plans, too. I was thinking that I'd start, like, a village on top of the arch as well. Because, I'll show you guys at night, but it is crazy huge up there. Let's just keep touring this place. So, you know, here's a tiny, tiny little room. Just, like, I'm, I do what I can in this archway. Um, and you know, I just make it work, um, and you know, you obviously gotta be in creative mode for this, otherwise this would take me months. I built this, no joke, in the course of like 15 hours. So this is where, um, creative mode comes in handy, otherwise this would take me weeks, and I would not be doing daily uploads, so, creative mode comes in handy. Oh, you know, just another little living room right here, keep going up the arch. Um, another little living space. I have to get kind of innovative with the stairs since they're, you know, inside of an archway. Oh, somebody left the door open to the patio. I'm glad that people are using it. Um, different types of trees and greenery up on these buildings. And would you look at that? That is our last, like, section of things that I have built. So let's just fly up inside of this arch. Isn't that just nuts? And now I'm flying down the other side. I, I mean, this is probably not the most, like, conventional way to go to the other side of the arch right now to show you guys, but, you know, time's of the essence. I know you guys have valuable time, so let's just keep it going. So, this part of the tower is still actually kind of underground because of, I wanted the entrances to be at ground level, and, um, and that, and the ground level on this side is kind of inside of, like, a mountain, so that's just what it is, so can't really do much about that. So, let's go ahead up and head down a level and we have like a little enchantment slash lector area for whatever type of uh, person wants to do that and then we're on the first floor over here so we just flew across the top of that archway and over to here so I mean it's progressing and stuff let's see what this um, zombie villager is up to is he a comrade yet oh yeah he is looking fine and dandy so let's get him out of here and, you know, this is a perfectly fine structure and everything like that, but we are so aesthetically pleasing with these New York subways and, uh, and this huge giant arch that I don't know if I should have this, like, ugly little dark building right here. I'll probably build something a little bit more um, interesting, but for the time being, I don't know. Should I put something in here? Um... I mean, it has a little roof and stuff. You know what? I bet I can make it... Ah, I just can't. I just can't bring myself to have that there. I'll destroy it later. But, um, but yeah, I'm trying to keep everything as fenced in as possible here. Um, so hopefully I want to get this area totally opened up. Obviously with fencing around it, though. I don't want people getting away. And, um, you know, I want to build another arch. I want to build an arch that either intersects with this one, you know, like coming in this direction, or one that's bigger than this one and goes over it. But I want this place to get, like, increasingly more futuristic and stuff like that. I built this in a day, so that's looking pretty cool. So actually, guys, I think next episode, what I'm going to be doing is working on some underground stuff. I might be working in the arch a little bit just so I can show you guys how cool it looks like with like uh, um, trees and windows all up in it. But let's, you know, shimmy past these uh, iron golems here. Excuse me, guys. Excuse, excuse me. Pardon me. Okay, so let's get past these guys. And let me show you guys what I have on the other side of this wall. I'm. This may be the wrong wall. <laughs> um... And I don't even have brick on me. Alright, let me show you guys what I have on the other side of this wall. So this, oh cool, got the cat out of here. Alright you guys, so this tunnel is going to continue in a very visually pleasing manner into this beautiful, gorgeous, natu naturally, naturally occurring ravine. It is just beautiful, guys. So what I'm going to do is like, when that 
get um, all finished up, I'm going to build a village in here. And it's going to be its very own little community, all self-contained within this ravine. And, you know, I might um, continue it into a cave and see how well villagers are, um, you know, okay with going into caves and stuff. But it's really going to expand our community of villagers. Um, and it's going to be pretty cool. So, man, it's just crazy with the iron golems right now. So let me actually... Now that we're in creative mode in a video, let me show you guys. That's what I was going for, with like a Minecraft character holding a cube. It looks like he's holding a cube of something with that structure, but I don't know. thought it would turn out a little better than it did, but man, guys, that arch is nuts. So let me just fly up here. I don't have any glass, do I? Should we make the top floor structure into something in this video? Let's do it, guys. Let me get some good old-fashioned glass really quick. Oh man, I had to use the one thing I kind of also needed. You know what we should also do, guys? Let's take a quick rest. Alright guys, you know what else we should do? Before we take a rest, let's get rid of these really annoying sheep that have just, like, taken it upon themselves to take over um, this tower. Um, these sheep are getting on my last nerve and let's rid ourselves of them. It is just packed full. I mean, where do they get off? And I don't know why they're trying to go up. Okay, I think that's all of them. How do I even sleep at night after doing something like that? I don't know, guys. Alright. Let's get right back into it. So now let's go up to that top floor of the arch and make a little, like, cool penthouse area. And what am I doing? How do I get outside? You know what? When you're in creative mode, you can take such liberties. Whoa! Okay. Where's it at? Over here? Let's head over to that top floor and make something cool. I think we should really knock out, like, most of this wall here. So I really don't want to compromise the shape of the arch here. So with this planter box that I'm going to be putting the trees in, I'm going to have to build this as a step up um, so I don't compromise the lower lip of this top portion here. And I don't want to build any skylights in this place because um, Oh man, that is just picturesque, untouched land right there. Let's open this up nice and big. Wow. If that doesn't make you optimistic for the future in Minecraft, I don't know what will. Let's get that floor to ceiling decked out with glass. Beautiful. And let's get some grass in here, guys. This is pretty, um, pretty dreary without uh, any... Um, grass up here. Up in there as well. And let's get some bone meal on these guys and see what they look like. Oh, that one's cool. What about this one? Oh, that was kind of uneventful. It kind of just like grew into the other one. Eh, that looks alright. Let's put some, let's get some grass around these trees. I just love the natural feel. Oh, and it, it spawns some flowers too. That's beautiful. Do we have any fencing? You know what, let's give this guy a little bit of a more special of a bed frame.
Alright guys, so I think this just gives it much more of an interesting vibe. Just a much cooler place for someone to hang out at. So let's head out on this dark porch, and this spider guy is reminding me of something. So let's get above these trees and get on top of the arch. The arch is so big that it spawns mobs. We've got a creeper, a spider, and uh, a skeleton guy out here. I switched over to survival mode, see if I still got it. Gotta get him over the edge. going full force at this guy. Got him. Oh, missing blocks here too. But like, no way a wizard spawned up here. Okay, who's even shooting arrows at me? See how big this is, guys? Ooh, no, 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 no. Okay, I got him. That would not have been good. But this is totally, like, they're totally able to navigate this. The villagers, I mean. So, I was thinking about building, like, villager areas up on top of this arch. Another creeper, seriously. Okay, got him. <sighs> Let's see if there's any more mobs up on top of the arch over here. Oh no! Oh man, that's so sad. Okay, at least it wasn't in the luxury area. Up on top. We got a wizard here. Throwing all types of stuff at me. Do I still got that milk? Ah, uh, you know I don't got it. That's just how I'm living. What potion is that? Is it called like potion of damage? Alright you guys, well thank you so much for checking it out. Um, next time, uh, next video, I think, man, what should I do for the next video? Next video, I think I'm going to switch back away from building, get back into survival mode. Uh, next video, let's go on an adventure on horseback and let's go find ourselves um, maybe not horseback, so I'm thinking I want to find, like, a shipwreck, guys. I've been meaning to find a sunken pirate ship and see what kind of cool treasures spawn in that pirate ship. So, that's what we'll do next video tomorrow, guys. Thank you so much for tuning in and checking it out. If you liked what you saw, be sure to subscribe. I'm doing daily uploads. Alright, thank you guys so much for checking in. Alright. Final, final try. All right, thank you guys so much for checking in. So we're going to continue working on this, but next video tomorrow, we're going to look for a uh, sunken pirate ship and see what kind of treasures are on there. So if you guys like what you saw and you want to see more of what's going to be going on with this archway and that underground area and all of my villagers, uh, be sure to subscribe and press that like button. I'm doing daily uploads. Thanks so much for checking it out, guys. See you next time. Bye.